Hey guys, K9 here today, and in this video, we are doing Pokemon Sword and Shield. I don't think this would be the finale, necessarily, but I mean like we've made it this far. Alright, King, correct? We've been watching over your performance in the gym challenge. This is a formality, of course, but I'll need to check your gym badges if you don't mind. I'm all sorted and ready to battle you on the biggest stage of them all, but it looks like Bead couldn't make it. Hard luck. Somehow, I didn't think he'd just take being disqualified lying down, you know what I mean. I guess it is what it is. Come on, Caden. We should head to the locker room. Attention gym challengers who have made it through the gym challenge. The semifinals will be starting soon. Please head to the stadium pitch when you are ready. I just want to take one good look at this room before I become champion. Hello. I'm sorry, but only authorized people are allowed to enter here. Oh boy, by the time I'm done, I will enter there. It's time for the semifinals. I'm very curious about who will win among the four who completed the gym challenge. Oh, when you're ready, please head to the pitch. Oh my gosh, this is our version of the Elite Four. At least I think. Who knows? Okay. First up. Who are we against? Marnie, okay. Heh, I knew you'd get all the badges and meet me here. I know that there's a, been a lot between us with what my big brother, Team Yell, helping Spike Myth and all that. And the truth is, well, when all is said and done, I really want to become champion for myself. So don't take it personal when I kick your butt. I should be saying that to you. Okay, we are here. Facing Marnie first. Alright. Still five Pokemon, that's a bad sign. That's a bad side of losing. Okay. Let's see where this goes. I've got to win this if I'm going to be champion. I'm coming at you with everything I've gotten. How about I just counter? Why is Scorch at this HP? Okay, so we'll do counter again, just in case when that point comes to us. Perfect. Could we counter that actually? Or does it fail? Does it fail? Ah, oh, okay. Luckily, luckily, I did buy some healing items. So like the full restore, got several hyper potions, Gotten plenty of uh, super potions and lots of potions. Uh, let's use a super potion first, just to kind of play safe. Okay. Uh, let's go for flame charge. Oh, that's not even much of a problem. Okay. Wait a second, doesn't Torment... Yeah. Well, bounce. Oh, okay. Well, it looks like we're still going to bounce either way. Let's see where this gets us. Here we go. And still didn't do enough. Okay, surely we cannot die from that. Okay. We're just gonna have to use the flame charge one more time. And then we're gonna kill that thing. There we go. That thing had a focus sash. Oh boy. Alright, let's see who's up next. At least in who we're facing. Scrafty. Okay, so wall. We'll switch out for the hmm I think it's dark and we're psychic screw it we're gonna have to stay like this even though this is definitely going to kill the hat we're just gonna do it like this but by the time that more peko comes out I think it's gonna be wiped out Okay. 
Let's go for Dazzling Gleam. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, because of that fairy type being perfect. There we go. Okay. Bandit levels up. Now let's see. Toxicroak. Ground types can work against that, right? Pretty sure they do. Alright, let's see where this gets us to. Okay. No, why'd I go for slam? I meant to glare. Okay, well that doesn't matter. Yeah, that that didn't matter either way. Okay, we'll go for the glare. Yes, okay. That's gonna have to do something in this battle. Unless if Bulldoze is just gonna straight up one shot. Okay, yeah, the Bulldoze does one shot. So we could have just gone for the Bulldoze. Maybe we could stay in with uh, Sniper. Okay. Or Paco. Yes, I knew it. Okay. So then... We could kill that thing with a Bulldoze, right? If not, then I'm going to be scared how that Toxicroak didn't survive it. All right. Got that all taken care of. No one's still leveled up. Grimmsnarl. Oh, I think I might know which Pokemon that is. Maybe. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for... Uh, let's go for Dasher. Dasher can definitely play a role in this. I've got everyone, everyone's cheering, cheers back in me. I, how did my reading, like, fail me? It was doing just good in the last video. Let's go for liquidation. I mean, bro, I might not use it, but I'll Gigantamax find Pokemon if it's to win. Gigantamax? Oh my gosh, no one on my team can Gigantamax. No one can. Maybe until I reach the Isle of Armor, then that's going to change for Scourge. But why do this to me now? Okay, we're still faster. I worked, I worked real hard training my favorite move. Oh no. Oh no, do we fall asleep? Ooh. Oh my gosh. Of course it was a crit. Let's just pray we don't die to that, to that one move. Okay. Please survive. Yes, perfect, perfect. That was why, why does this happen to me? Oh, this is bad. Oh, this, this wouldn't work for Bandit. Oh boy, this battle though. All right, uh, let's go for the glare. Oh, wait a second, that's her last Pokemon. I didn't know that. Oh no. No, 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 no. That's gonna. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, I didn't even know that that was her last Pokemon. Still. I thought, like, Marnie had no strategy when it came to that. But now thinking about it, she does have some sort of strategy. I guess. Kind of like everyone else. But in the meantime. She's most likely going to be dead at this point. So, okay, here we are. We're way bigger than that thing too. Woke up. Oh, okay, so attack and defense froze. So, that thing might survive. Probably will. 
but I guess not. All right, we did it. Don't take it personally, Marnie. That's those words that you said to me. Now I get to cheer my victory with Sniper. Okay, so I lost, but I got to see a lot of good a lot of the good points of you and your Pokemon. What's your speech now? Everyone in the stadium was watching us during all that. I heard them cheering for me and my Pokemon. It was so nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Guess that's not so bad. I think I'll join my brother in the stands and we'll watch from the sidelines to see who ends up challenging the champion. That's gonna be me, just so you know. I still haven't decided if I'm gonna cheer for you. See ya. How dare you, Barney? <laughs> I'm ready to see Hop. Yes, I knew it. Caden, I'll be waiting for you in the final match. After seeing the way you battled, I can't accept any outcome besides winning this match. My team is on fire. I need a heal. Pardon me. I know you didn't get a long break, but the match before yours ended way more quickly than expected. Challenger Hop won quite handily, so as soon as you're ready, we'd like to we'd like you back on the pitch. Is my team healed though? Okay, as long as it's healed, we're good. Here we go, we're up against Hop. But the question is, who on earth did Hop face? Who did he face? Okay, here we go. I just had this sort of flashback, you know. Remember back when we were still in Potswick? Wait, when we got our Pokemon from Wii that day. I never would have dreamed that I'd end up standing here facing you of all people. We're still gonna be hot though. By the time I finish who what well, was started that day, got it. The one who will become champion is me. I'm gonna be the champion. I'm gonna shove Leon's words to the ground. Cause I'm tired of him bragging. Okay. Got challenged by a Pokemon trainer hop. He didn't do the thing he usually does, so he's finally taking things seriously. Maybe not that seriously if he's really going to do that against Scorch. But anyways, we battled back in the garden, but I'm really fired up for this match in the stadium. Okay, counter. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna do twice that damage back, I'm pretty sure. All right, good enough, full flame charge. Just so then, A, we can get faster, and B, that was the perfect kill. There we go, Slowpoke finally leveled up to level 50, even though we've used the hat more. Snorlax. You know what, that thing, that thing could use something like Body Slam or Gyro Ball. I'm expecting Snorlax to know one of those two moves. Oh, perfect. We get to smack that right back at his face. How's that? I learned a lot by studying Lee's old matches. Well, I wonder how you like this. Yeah, because we still move faster. That might not kill. Okay. You know what? Maybe I went a little too cocky. Yeah, I was too cocky for that one. Okay, don't worry, we still have that Rillaboom coming up next. So, we'll last when we're Sniper. Yeah, we'll use Sniper. No, why do I use Sniper? Dasher. How do I get those two names mixed up? Um, Let's just go for a Liquidation. Just so then that can kill. That's not going to kill anymore. Okay, yeah. Yeah, let's just... That was a crit, wasn't it? That wasn't a crit? Oh my gosh. That looked like it was a crit. We did it. Okay, he's probably gonna send out Rillaboom next. An urchin. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll switch. Uh... For Bandit. 
our second strongest member on the team. Not that far from levels when it comes to him and Scorch. Just one level level. Oh, he's saving Rillaboom last, okay. That thing must have iron barbs or some physical move to do something. So let's go for the home cause. All right, curse, okay. So something lowers, I forgot what it was. Is it speed or defense? Speed, okay. Then it upgrades its attack and defense, okay. So let's go for another home claws. Just to make sure that we have extra damage for our next attack. Poison jab. Okay, that can be really bad. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, you know what? We're gonna have to risk it and go for the foul play. Cause that should kill. All right. Okay, it's going for the curse again. So now it's attack and defense is doubled twice and it's speed lowered twice. Okay. So then, because we're a physical attacker, yeah, we can go for any of these three moves, but obviously I'm going to go for foul play. I'm still glad they didn't change that in Sword and Shield compared to Sun and Moon. All right, then we'll go over to, it's either we should go for the hat or Corviknight. Oh, he's using Rillaboom last, okay. Uh, so let's not go for the hat, because that thing is steel type. We'll go for, hmm. We'll just go for Slowpoke, just to see where this goes. For level 50 though too. That's a funny thing about this one. Okay, Corviknight. I wanna see where this gets us. All right, thank goodness we don't have any berries equipped it on us. Oh wait, for a second. Oh, okay. We'll just go for the surf. Yes, we have some of that big wave against Corviknight. Now, Zen Headbutt and Psychic. Uh, or the Special Defense. Ooh, okay, you know what? We could go for Psychic. Just to attempt... Uh-oh. Just to attempt to lower the, uh, the Special Defense. So then we can use Surf. And then that'll bring us to a solid advantage, I'd say. Okay, let's see. We'll lower the Special Defense. It might not. Okay, how about we, how about we just straight up revive Scorch? All right, just to kind of save him for that Rillaboom. That's right, because we're confused. We're just gonna have to risk going for the Psychic. Okay, how many times are you gonna be using Drill Pack? Yes, okay. All right. Yes, the special defense fell. Perfect, we'll go for serve. Just to inflict a little bit more damage this time. And then, how much will that do? Okay, we definitely did more. Uh, let's heal up by using a super potion. Cause let's not go for a hyper potion yet. There we go. It's probably gonna use drill pack, okay, again. We can definitely go for one or two more serves. Jeez, these Pokemon know one move all the freaking time. Okay, okay. We'll see if we can move first with Zen Head, but no, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we're dead. That's why we're gonna go to Bandit. No, let's not go for Bandit. How about we go for Dasher? Just to let him gain a couple more experience points because 
he's behind when it comes to him and Sniper. Uh, let's go for Crunch. That should kill. Yeah, all right. Oh, the hat leveled up. Finally to level 50. Now our whole team is level 50 and above. Well, let's have old rivals meet. We may be at a little bit of a disadvantage, but we should one shot with the pirate wall. Oh, he's gonna Dynamax, okay. Think you got me back in the corner? No way, this will just be my victory, all the better. I have definitely gotten him back into the corner. Okay, surely he's going to Dynamax, which is why we're gonna go for the Max Flare. All right. He's probably gonna Dynamax too. So, let's see where this gets us to. We're just looking straight down at him. At least all the thoughts poured into my wishing star. Time for a Dynamax. All right, here we go. I like how Hop seems pretty confident. And how he almost fell over at the end. Okay. Here we go. Old rivals meet. And we did one shot. I knew you'd be aiming for a super effective hit. Well, of course. I mean, like, what? Will we just go into Dasher or Sniper and just take it like that? All right, there we go. Oh, 58. And all done. Uh-oh. Kane, thanks, mate. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. And the victor of the semifinals, the, ch the challenger who has won their way through all of the many hopeful trainers in the gym challenges, Challenger Caden. You know, even when Sonia was saying that you and me looked like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate, I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Caden and Cinderace and all the rest of your team. I'm gonna say good game to hop. Ooh, okay. Everyone's here. Of course, Leon is here. Caden, that was incredible, brilliant. Honestly, there were even tears rolling down my face before I knew it. To think that you, that the two of you set out together from the same town, built up the greatest teams, and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another. That burning desire to win, those moves filled with undefeatable passion. It was battling at its very purest in every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you, you were fit to be endorsed with the gym challenge at first. That was you, Lee. Well then, all the more reason. My team members and I will give everything that we've got in us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might as well end up being you, Caden. In fact, that's precisely, precisely what I'm hoping for. That's right, Caden. The real challenge is what's coming next. I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best to refill your energy source first. Why don't we go t get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but you never care at all what food tastes like, we. A night that this deserves more than rubbish takeaway. So I'll at least pick something good. All right, so we are going to be eating with the champion and his little brother, I guess, because we're getting something to eat. Is this the next day already? Challenger Caden. Hey, Challenger Caden. Got some time for questions? First question. You and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in a sense when you say. How does it feel to have defeated your rival? I'm glad I could beat him. It doesn't feel real yet. It was just like that one. Hmm. 
I'm gonna be nice and say it doesn't quite feel that real yet. Right, question number two. If you wanted to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? I thank him for the great match. Question three, level with me, kiddo. kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think you can win the finals too? I absolutely will. All right, that's enough. Caden's already tired from battle. And you've been asking rather rude questions. We got ourselves dinner plans with my brother. So sorry, but clear off, okay, would you? Yes, yes, I understand. Look forward to seeing the birth of a new star. Phew, famous people sure have it rough, eh? I hope we get to soon. I keep my own arm about now. Several hours later. This is absurd. Even when he's never this late, something's not right. He always does what he says he'll do. As a kid, he promised me he'd become champion one day, and he went and did just that. He ought to be able to keep to his own dinner plans. Kids sure got a mouth on him, huh? If you were that noisy during battle, you don't unleash a whole new level of power, you know. Oh, pack it in, Pierce. I'm seriously worried here. So I don't need to see your smug mug looking like you're having a go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. Judging by appearances, no wonder you lost to your mate. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him heading to Rose Tower. Why would he go there? Don't know what he's up to, but I ran into him at the monorail platform. He said to tell you that he had something to do at Rose Tower, so he'd be late to your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to do there at this hour? Pierce, do us a favor. Take us to Rose Tower, would you? Neither Kane nor I had no other way. Jeez, what rude siblings always so demanding of others. Though I suppose it's a real problem for me, too, if the finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you, Lorenz. You were good enough to beat me, after all. So I think I'll invite Team Yo along, and we'll all have ourselves a bit of fun, shall we? Brilliant, you're the best, Pierce. Let's go make a real ruckus. Oh boy, what is going on? Alright. Um, I think that's gonna conclude our video because, I mean, I, who knows what's coming up next. I don't even know what's coming up next, obviously. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I shall see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys. Perfect.